Maintenance. I've spoken about it many times in the past. And um, I've got this old Honda Accord here. It's a 95. And I just changed the oil on it. I literally, I have not pulled it off the lift yet. The oil that came out of this thing was mud. Left the drain plug out forever. You know, had the oil filter out forever. Just to try to get as much out of the motor as possible. So now I just changed the oil. And I want to show you what it looks like. So here, I haven't put the stick in yet. I mean, I have, but I just cleaned it off. You see, it's clean. So now, now this is brand new oil. It has zero miles on it. See how dirty that is? I mean, that's disgusting. It's dirty. It's filthy. So that tells you right then and there, this car has not been maintained. Now, yeah, granted, it's an old Honda, but it's only got 83,000 miles on it. It's just not well maintained. It doesn't go very far. Yeah, it just kind of stays around town. But who knows when the last oil change was? It could have been 10,000 miles ago. And it could have been 10,000 miles in 10 years. You know? But I actually, I've had it in the past where people don't change their oil. They come in for an oil change. I change the oil. And then they complain. My oil's not clean. Well, yeah, no kidding. No kidding it's not clean. You can't get all the oil out of the engine. There's pockets in there where the oil sits. And you're, you're going to get clean oil that mixes with dirty oil. It's going to look dirty. You want to have clean oil? Change your oil more often. So, it just I just wanted to point that out. Because for some reason, people seem to think, oh, you change your oil, it's going to be nice and clean. Well, no. No, it's not. You know, even if you didn't have pockets where oil collected, you still have oil on the walls inside the motor, you know, on the... Uh, on a block and the base of the oil pan, you're never going to get all the oil out. Even what, even if you pull an engine apart and you start tipping stuff over, oil pours out of different areas. You know, it happens. Oil sits there. It doesn't get out of every single area. It's in every single uh, oil passage, too. So, you know, how much oil that equates to, I don't know. But I just thought it'd be interesting to see that. I mean, I literally have not even taken this thing off the lift yet. You know, it's still there. So I'm going to put the dipstick back in it, put an oil change sticker on it, put it outside. That's it. Get anything out of my videos, hit that like button. If you could, please subscribe. Have a great day. Keep wrenching.